So you want to buy a new set of speakers for your car and there are plenty of options available for you. Are the cheap speakers even good enough? And are the most expensive speakers even really worth it? So today we're inside a BMW 4 Series which we're doing a full sound system makeover on the vehicle. But before we get onto that, we're gonna be talking you through how to choose speakers for your vehicle, the price, how we're installing it, as well as right at the end of the video, we're gonna be sitting in the car, listening to it, and seeing if it's really worth it. I have a feeling it will be. My name's Ardil, and you're watching Cambridge Car Audio. <laughs> All right, so first things first, you actually need to choose the system itself, and there are loads of options available for you. And that's actually one of the reasons why people get confused. So I'll be completely honest with you, it completely depends on the vehicle that you have. And that's why we design and spec each system individually for our clients. Basically, because every system is different and varies depending on car, let's actually take an example of a car, a BMW 3 Series. I have actually designed four different packages that are shown right here that allow you to actually go through different options and timescales varying from 500 pounds all the way up to 15,000 pounds. And these are systems I've designed specifically for all of the BMW range. So when you buy a BMW, it comes with three different systems from stock. You have the base system, Hi-Fi and then Harman Kardon. So why should you know this? Basically, the system that you have from stock will affect, obviously, the option that you go for with our packages. So let's jump right into the actual packages that we've designed for the BMW range. So here we have package one. This comes in around about 600 pounds fitted, plus also can be done within one day. What this system is, is a new front set of speakers comprising of a tweeter and a four inch, and this is really gonna help with your clarity of the system. However, if you own a car that already has Harman Kardon as stock, I probably wouldn't recommend this as stage one because you're not changing the amplification, you're not changing too much along the line, you're changing the last thing, which is just the component. So here we have package number two. This system can be installed for just over £2,000, plus it only takes two days to do the install. In terms of this system, this is a really nice package for those of you who either have the base system or have Harman Kardon because we're adding in lots of different features away from what we had in package one. The big difference that you're gonna have is the base increase because we're adding in the 18 inch woofers underneath the seat, but also more soundproofing, which builds a better environment for the system to work in. Not only that, you also get amplification. This then gives you volume, clarity, the only thing it really lacks is the ability to have a lot of control over the system. And that comes in the next package. So here we have package three. This system can be installed for just over 3,000 pounds. It's about a thousand pound more than package two. And it takes around about five days to do this install. The big difference you're getting here is the amplification. What it allows you to do is actually do time alignment so we can tune the car as well and actually customize the sound to exactly how you want. But also you get an increase in clarity and volume from this setup. So now let's move on to the custom system in package four. So this is special. System four. This is a system that values in at an estimated 15,000 pounds and it takes around about 25 days to do the actual install. If you wanna go ahead with this, all the details can be found on our website, but it doesn't stop there. The options are literally endless. And this is a product here. So this is called the Audison Thesis Venti. This amplifier is 10,000 pounds and it's a two channel amplifier that for instance, will just run a set of tweeters. Give you guys an example. I was drawing up a quote a little bit earlier on today. This is a quote on a supercar. This system values in at 77,000 pounds. Yeah. I know you're blown away by that, but if we had more space, for instance, in a Range Rover, Rolls Royce, something just basically a lot bigger than a supercar, we could pretty much double that or triple that into a system going into a car, which is literally just insane. I hope that this has actually helped you guys, but in return of that, if it has done, it really help our business, but also helps that YouTube algorithm. If you could like this video, but also smash that subscribe button. But for now, let's jump back into the car and show you more. So the BMW speaker system in the car sounds really bad. In terms of giving you guys at home a bit of a reference point in terms of how good a car can sound. 
That's why we've invested into our demo car. Our client came by, sat in the vehicle, listened to it, and really wanted to replicate that quality sound inside his own vehicle. So, obviously you just had to listen to the demo car. Yep. What are your first thoughts? Amazing. Yeah? Yeah, I want something like that. <laughs> we need to get your car sound like that. So our client wanted an audio system to sound as close as possible to our demo car. He wanted to spend around £3,000 on a new system, but didn't know what was possible. So we helped him design the best system for his budget. The way we have got kind of the initial plan at the moment is basically using these products. So this is the under seat woofer. So that's gonna sit completely underneath your seat, out of sight, but it's gonna give you a lot more depth towards the front. But they've got quite a bit of weight to them, haven't they? Yeah, yeah, it's nice. It feels quality. In the end, he went for an eight channel Audison amplifier, two under seat subwoofers, a new front set of speakers comprising of a tweeter and a four inch mid range, as well as a coaxial rear set of speakers and then full soundproofing across all the doors with a total price of around about £3,300 fitted. Yes, it won't be quite as good as our demo car, but it will blow anything else out of the water with its volume, clarity, as well as bass. Currently completely stripped out. It's interesting to see it all out. It's a bit surreal as well, you like. <laughs> so before listening to the final result, let's quickly run you through what goes on in the install. First thing we do is a little briefing. We talk about things like products going in, placement, as well as the deadlines. Then we strip the car down, gain access to the old speakers, remove them, soundproof everything, then install the new speakers, put everything back together. And then we also tune the audio system so it sounds acoustically perfect. Finally, after all that hard work is done, it's now time to surprise our customer with their beautiful new system. Let's start off and enjoy. You excited? Yes. <laughs> so obviously in terms of here, you basically, your controls are completely the same. You do everything as you did before, but it just sounds slightly, slightly different. <laughs> <laughs> you ready? Yes, I'm ready. struggling to yeah. listen to it even well I think above halfway or so wasn't it yeah. saying before when I was younger and you had like subs in the boot it was nothing compared to this yeah, yeah. this is the quality do you know what I mean before it was like you know the yeah, yeah. But this is the just neighborhood so nerve yeah. yeah, <laughs> it's just quality the sound quality is amazing thank you so much for watching today's video I really hope you've enjoyed it and learned a little bit more about the BMW sound systems that we offer all of our details are in the description below otherwise smash that subscribe button and we'll see you on the next one we're giving away a brand new PlayStation 5 and a controller as well as an Audison Prima amplifier so you guys at home can upgrade the system in your vehicle as soon as we hit 10,000 subscribers on YouTube so help us out smash that subscribe button and you can be in the chance we're winning all this